Hey guys, this is Mr. V and this is Apes Review Video, Topic 5.1, The Tragedy of the Commons. And this is the beginning of Unit 5. So what is the Tragedy of the Commons? It's um, basically this idea that resources on the planet tend to be very limited. We don't get a lot of them, okay? And because of that, the individuals have to share these resources. And so, um, unfortunately, we as humans, uh, we tend to act in our own self-interest, right? So we uh, tend to be at a sacrifice of the common good. So a lot of the common uh, resources end up getting depleted. And because of that, you see a significant difference in those things. So uh, problems arise with public resources. So let's say you have this public piece of land and you're going to allow your sheep to graze on that land. Well, the downside is when you have all these sheep grazing on that land, um, they're going to end up uh, taking too much. And, you know, because of the fact that there's little consequences to the person who had the sheep, there's, you know, this tragedy of the commons. That's the idea that um, this common resource ends up, um, you know, overused. And so one of the possible solutions of this is privatization. The idea is that, well, what if we just uh, sectioned off and said, this is only yours? Then if that became, um, if that was part of the solution, then what you could do with this is you could then put the responsibility onto the individual owners and they themselves would probably allow for less overgrazing and overuse of this um, in this case. Okay. And so some real life examples of this would be like overgrazing in pastures, um, overfishing in the oceans, and overhunting. So here's an example of uh, the passenger pigeon. Okay, the passenger pigeon went extinct um, because it was this common bird that would just fly over and people could just uh, go outside and shoot into the skies and they would literally sell passenger pigeon meat um, by the ton. Okay, and so it can show you how much uh, there was at the time. And unfortunately, with the lack of uh, regulation, the species went extinct um, early in the 1900s. And um, so that's a good example of how this, uh, this can occur. So if you'd like to do a little bit of more reading, here's a resource for you. And, uh, you know, hopefully that was helpful to you.